you must be the new student I've heard so much about. You made quite a name for yourself on Unicorn Way. I'm Mr. Lincoln, and I just have some quick paperwork to get you enrolled. Signature here, initials there, and a lock of hair here. Are you allergic to unicorns or eyes of Newt? Good, that takes care of that. To complete your enrollment, come meet your professors. Welcome. I am the professor of the ice where we teach thaumaturges to endure like permafrost, withstanding all attacks. While in the storm school, we instruct young diviners to strike hard, fast as lightning, defeat the enemy before they know what hit them. We pyromancers of the fire school prefer to carefully fan the flames, utilizing damage over time spells. We slow burn our enemies to cinder. Commanding the elements is indeed impressive, but theurgists of the life school seek harmony with nature, which gives us the power to heal others. Sorcerers also seek harmony. Symmetry in all things balances unique magic from Crocotopia, which supports and enhances the other schools. Fireballs and flowers, fresh Imagine that all wizards summon monsters to fight for us, but only the best conjurers dare study the ways of myth. And I'm Malone, not um, exactly a professor. <laughs> we haven't had a real deaf professor since the last one turned evil and destroyed the school, so. Um, but I can get you started at being a necromancer. Our death spells drain health from enemies, damaging them and healing ourselves at the same time. <laughs> As the official interim teacher of death magic, I can get you started as a necromancer. Let's just get out of the way. Welcome to the crater where the deaf school used to be. Until Headmaster Ambrose finds a replacement for Malister, you can come to me to train. I can even teach you advanced deaf spells when you reach the right level of experience. Probably. I'll let you know when that is. For now, I've got one spell for you. Ghoul. Train it, then head back to Mr. Lincoln. You're already learning multi-pip spells? Oh, splendid! At the beginning of each round of combat, some spells, like this one, take more than one pip to cast. To use it, pass a turn, or cast a zero pip spell to build up your pip supply. Met your professor. Great! You can train spells in your school for free, but to learn other school spells, you must spend training points. Here, I'll give you one now. Use it to start training a secondary school. And if you change your mind later, see me to buy back training points. Anyway, now that you're enrolled, you get your own dorm room to store items and decorate however you want. This is the boys' dorm here. And this is the girl's dorm. You can also use the go home button to reach your... Once you get settled in, report to the headmaster. You're officially enrolled now? <laughs> then let me formally welcome you with this new healing spell. Let me also introduce you to our resident advisor, Abby K. Doodle. She can tell you all about our many electives uh, when you have time. But on to more serious matters. It seems the troubles in Unicorn Way were but the tip of an evil iceberg. While you were gone, Chaos erupted all over the city. Undead run amok in the streets, and our former allies have turned against us. Malister must be behind this. Your victory on Unicorn Way makes you the perfect person to deal with this crisis. I foresaw you might save Wizard City. Now's your chance. Go to Old Town and talk to Sergeant Muldoon immediately. We must set things right and discover Malister's goal in all this. Good luck. 
one last word before you embark on your quest. I've tried to answer most of the questions. If you haven't... Come to me. I am just outside the dual arena on Unicorn Way. Beware! Beyond these gates, the city's gone mad. Wait, you're the hero of Unicorn Way. The headmaster sent you to help? <laughs> Thank goodness. We've got undead all over the place. Every cursed spirit and vile ghost we sealed away has broken free and attacked the city. Nowhere is safe. Huh? Uh, now what? Oh, <laughs> well, it's a pet. They're kind of like a wizard's familiar. They help out in all sorts of ways, from discovery to dueling. But it shouldn't be in that tower. That's the caretaker's tower. Nobody's been in there since old Judd, the keeper of the cemetery, passed. Oh, right. Undead. Wizard, go with the pet. Work together and find out what's happening in that tower. Greetings, young. Yeah. Come to this tower. No, shouldn't have done that. Gonna interfere with things don't concern you. Like my plan to turn all pets into zombie pets. I hope you'll see you will when it comes to pets. Sometimes undead is better. If you have a pet equipped, it can help you in battle. Itself, I did. You can't get through those bars, no how. What? That's terrible. We have to get into that kennel. But how? Huh? Oh, I'm Penny Dreadful. I'm new here. When I saw this zombie guy stealing the pets, I tried to stop him and I guess I need more practice. You were great though. But I don't suppose you have any shrinking spells to help us slip through those bars? Oh! What about your pet? It's pretty small. Can you command it to go into the next room and get the key? You are now commanding your pet, allowing you to get to places and see things wizards can't. Use this ability to enter the next room.
Now that your pet. Great! Now let's go save all those poor pets. Ah, these cells have combination locks, and only old Judd would know the code. I mean, maybe the captive pet saw him put in the correct combo, but I don't speak pet. Do you? I'm seriously asking. Maybe we can guess the combo. Let's see. Zero, 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 one. Nope, not it. Zero, 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 two. Not it. Forget it. This is ridiculous. Our only sensible option is to find some way to talk to these captive pets and get the combo. Yep, I saw that smelly guy put in the combo lots of times. It's zero, 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 three. to learn all about pet training. After they're safe, I'll go to the headmaster's office and complete my enrollment. Come find me when you get a chance. For right now, though, go tell the guard outside what's happened here. You saved the pets and a young student? Not bad. But our work is just beginning and I need all the help I can get. Speaking of which, yup, with this tap. I've got alarming reports from Cyclops Lane and Triton Avenue, and I haven't heard anything out of Firecat Alley. So, where do you want to start? Triton Avenue's being overrun by the undead. I don't have any guards left to try and deal with it either. You're not the first student to offer help. Two wizards named Griffin Bane went in a little while ago, and there was another named Grimwater. But none of them have come out, and I've gotten no word. Can you help me try to find them? Good luck, and above all, be careful. You've just received a pet snack. You can feed pet snacks to your pet after it completes a training game. I'm lucky you came along. Something has broken the flow of storm magic through the street. Those towers should have arcs of lightning between them. This is bad. My sister Susie and I came to see if we could help get things back under control, but we got separated. The haunted minions drove me back. Can you create a diversion so I can try to break through? Attack the minions, and I'll meet you by the river. Help, wizard. I wouldn't have gotten here without you. I'm worried something terrible has happened. On my way here, I saw one of the lightning eels with Susie's wand in its jaws. 
Maybe she just dropped it, but maybe not. What can we do? I couldn't help but overhear. You're very loud. If you can bring me that wand, I may be able to assist. Really? How? Duncan Grimwater, Necromancer. I was drawn here by a massive surge of death magic. It must be the reason the undead have overrun the street. I wish Malastair were here. He could stop all this madness instantly. If only he were still alive. Malastare is alive? Impossible. I don't know what you saw, but you must be mistaken. Someone is trying to deceive you and Professor Ambrose. Malastare was a great man, the greatest necromancer of this age. Ambrose is responsible for what happened to him. If he hadn't... Can we talk about this later? My sister's lost out there. You're right. Wizard, bring me that wand, and I think I can get to the bottom of this. I can sense it from her wand. I think I can find her, but there's one more thing I need. I know a ritual that could grant me a vision of wherever Susie is. It's very advanced. I'm not surprised you don't know. The connection between Susie and her wand is one anchor for the ritual, but I need another, and I think I know what will work. When I was trying to reach the source of the death magic, I ran afoul of the rotting fodder across the river. They're using storm magic. That doesn't make any sense. Why are they using storm magic instead of death? They were wearing strange amulets that were crackling with storm energy. Bring me those amulets and I can cast my spell. what I can see. If I'm right, and I usually am, whoever's enchanting these storm amulets also kidnapped Susie. They probably have Susie imprisoned close by. I can use the link between the wand and Susie to find her, and the link between the storm amulets and their maker to produce a vision. Here goes. Nothing. Whoever this is, they have some powerful magic. I think I could break through the interference with a charged Lumina crystal. They make Lumina crystals at the mill across the river. Go talk to Blad Raven Eye and get us a crystal. Lumina crystal, you're out of luck. The undead stole all my crystals. I've got lots of raw crystal. I could grind you another one, but the mill's broken. Undead stole the wheel cogs and scattered them all over. But even if I could grind you a crystal, I couldn't charge it. My lightning rod won't work. A Scarlet Screamer stole the primary coil. You could help get me up and running again. Gather up the cogs and get my coil back from the Scarlet Screamers, and I'll get you a crystal.
Cogs to good use and get the old wheel turning. I'll fix the lightning rod. Oh, we're ready. Here, just pull this lever and we'll charge that lumina crystal right up. Ah, well done, wizard. Thanks to you, I'm back in business. Here you are, one brand new fully charged Lumina Crystal. She's a beauty. I hope she serves you well. A Lumina Crystal! This should be just what we need. The Lumina Crystal will boost the power of my ritual. It'll work this time, I'm sure of it. It's working! Susie, I can see her. But what was that horrifying thing with her? That's the Harvest Lord. We studied him in class. He's a powerful spirit from the underworld who harvests the souls of the innocent. It looked like she's in Galvano's tower. That must be where the Harvest Lord is enchanting the storm amulets. Wizard, please free my sister. Ah, another soul to harvest. I knew my little prisoner would draw more to me, like flies to honey. <laughs> Wait, my dark master warned me about you. Ha! Imagine the reward he will give me when I present him your very soul. Help!
fodder armed with storm magic to attack wizard city but there's more the tempest nexus up on the ridge channels storm energy into triton avenue the harvest lord diverted the flow of energy to enchant the amulets but after he finished the amulets he directed the flow back on itself the nexus will explode and take triton avenue with it use the teleporter by the mill to reach the tempest nexus i'll meet you up there Worse than I thought. The Nexus could explode at any moment. The controls, uh, they aren't working. I can't set it right. Professor Bellstrom knows more about storm magic than anyone. Go ask him for help. I'll try to keep the Nexus stable. Hurry. You can... You've gained greater power, I see. <laughs> Come find me. Hello, wizard. What? The Tempest Nexus is going to explode. Oh, dear me. We can't have that. Here, take this master key, bring it against the metal of the Nexus three times, and the feedback loop should end. Good luck, and move quickly. If you mark your location, click the recall button to return to your mark. to see him again. Harvest Lord has been driven back into the shadows, and the storm energy is flowing again. There's still a lot of undead roaming around, but without the Harvest Lord to direct them, we can handle them. I'll help. So, the Harvest Lord said he had a dark master. Track that master down, wizard, so Malastare's memory can be redeemed. Maybe you should leave that for later. For now, tell Sergeant Muldoon that things are calming down. Brighton Avenue's not going to explode? Well, I should hope not. Sounds like things are getting sorted out. Order relief. Thanks, wizard. 